It's all in your head. How are y'all? So what's up? You missed the sky. The sky? Yeah? <laughs> Sounds like something I would say. Can y'all say, hello, Busby? Hello, Busby. Well, Busby was flying along one day, but all of a sudden, the baby bees, there's the baby bees. The baby bees, Busby goes, uh, uh, hi, baby bees, and the baby bees goes, oh, 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 oh Busby, we're, we're, we're afraid, we're, we're, we're scared, we're, we're, we're not sure what's going on, and, and, and Busby said, why, why are you afraid? Well, the bee said, oh, we heard we heard half a noise. You, you heard half of a noise? Well, what's half a noise? Well, I'm not sure, but it was so loud, I wasn't going to wait around for the other half. And, and, and Busby said, well, I think it's in your imagination that you're afraid. I think that's what it is. Let's go see what that half a noise was. And so Busby and the baby bees, they fly down the trail. And they, 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 they see um, um, there's, a, there's a bird chirping. And, and yeah, it's caught in a trap. And, and they said, that must have been the half a noise we heard. That bird chirping. And, and, and so let's see if we can help this bird out, okay? And so they go and they let the trap open and let the bird fly away. <laughs> and Busby said, see there, that wasn't anything to be afraid of. In fact, and it, it was something to be helpful with, right? We could help the bird out. Compassion. Huh? Show compassion. show compassion to the bird instead of just being afraid when you heard something that you didn't know what it was. Oftentimes we get afraid of things, don't you? You ever get afraid at night? In the dark? In the city? In the, in the where? In the city? In the study? City. In the city you get afraid. Okay. Sometimes I get afraid in the dark. Yeah. Alone, or when I hear a, when I hear half a noise, yeah. So, what what makes you afraid sometimes? What being alone? In a dark room. When you're like, when I'm like on a high building and like there's like a cliff, and you just look down it. On a high building, there's a cliff, and you just look down. Are you on high buildings a lot? Uh, no. No. Okay. <laughs> Are you on cliffs a lot? No, okay. But when you are, it can be scary, right? Yeah. Okay. Something that was scary as a taxpayer, that we have this sign on the hill that we stand on. And like, if you just took a wrong step, you would fall back and hurt yourself bad. Yeah, you didn't want to fall off camp. Yeah, fall off a hill. Yeah. The ocean scares you? Okay. You don't know what's in it. Yeah. It was like the ocean is calm, but sometimes the wind was blowing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You never know what's in there. Well, so, so really, the fear of the unknown, the fear of what we don't know, it's often what scares us, right? Well, you know what? Whenever you get scared like that, you know who's with you? God. That's right. God, the Holy Spirit's with you. And if you can't... Realize and don't think of that. Just think of Bus Busby sitting on your shoulder. You're not alone, okay? <laughs> no, actually, God will be with you, right? <laughs> <laughs> Let us pray. Dear God, thank you for always being with us. When we're afraid, let us know that you're beside us. And give us strength. In Jesus' name, amen. All right. Now, if you, this king, I think, has some little... Oh, that, Jolene. Oh, oh, yeah, Jolene provided y'all with these Advent, uh, I'm sorry, Lent calendars. And what you can do is each day of Lent, which starts this Wednesday, you'll scratch out the square and see what it says. Okay? So, I guess I need to get up. I'm going to help you.